So this week, a couple places had sales at Hot Wheels. Um, I think it was Kmart, Dollar General, Toys R Us, and uh, Walgreens. Only bought something from uh, Dollar General and uh, Walgreens. Um, we'll start off with the stuff I bought from Walgreens, and then we'll make our way to the end of the week. Um, I bought this on Sunday. It's a Nissan 37OZ from 2015. Um, this is one that I skipped over originally, but um, I saw it again. I, they had it in like a on the pegs there, on the little side shelf that they have. They didn't really get anything new, I don't think. Most of the stuff was kind of old. Um, I picked this up mainly because I like the white color. Oh, I like I like the white stuff. Looks real nice. It, it kind of looks cleaner, I think. It's from A case. Next I got was the Humvee. This is one I passed over. I think it might be a metal base with a plastic body. I got this at Walgreens, 69 cents as well on coupon. It, you had to get it on coupon. And if you didn't get it, um, today's Saturday. So um, today's the last day for that. So I don't know if they have anything on sale on Sunday because uh, of Easter. Uh, is over with by then. Next one, next four things I got from Walgreens, uh, Walmart. Um, new for 2016, the Tank Nader. I might do a special video on my newer cars. Um, I got two new ones, so I'll do a video on this one too. I think you can put a minifigure in here. I, I don't know if it's a Mega Bloks figure. I think on one it says, or it can be a Lego figure. But I'll show you that later. Oh, as you can see, the adhesive is coming off. Seems to be a common problem now. I think they only had one of these in the dump bin they had. The dump bin was kind of wrecked. Um, it was like one of those uh, dump bins with the three dividers in it. And it was kind of bent over. And I didn't notice that until I started clearing out stuff. And then I found some stuff underneath there. The little wedge or whatever you want to call it. Okay, next one is almost as hard to find as a treasure hunt. Um... I only ever found three of these. I found uh, uh, two 2014 ones in the middle of 2015. I traded one, and I also have a loose one, though. I might keep this one carded. Not really different than the old one. Um, it has been released three times already. This is from the F case. Snoopy on top. Um, I think in the cartoon he was on top. I think he was, when he sat on top, he was like the Red Baron. And he would fly, he would uh, pretend to fly his doghouse around like a plane. I haven't seen Snoopy since I was a kid, though. Don't really watch too much of the, uh, whatchamacallit, the holiday specials. But here's the Snoopy. Um, I'm not sure if it, this Snoopy comes off, but I don't know how, if it does on there. But, um, just the wheels are a little different when we look at them together. Yeah, there's the little open spokes. These are like closed spokes. So it's a metal doghouse. It's real nice. I'd rather have it metal than plastic. And the engine part is metal. With a plastic base. Pretty nice. I keep this displayed on my uh, Hot Wheels display shelf that I built. Okay, the next thing is the Combat Medic from the HW Art Car Series. Um, all the cars in those series have a letter on top. This one's letter A. This A kind of reminds me of the uh, A-Team A. I used to watch A Team, and they had, a, you know, they would show it at. The, I don't know if it was on the DVD, but they had an A like that, and that's what it kind of reminds me of. And these tamples, they look like from another series they did. Um, I think they had a series of cars where they put stuff like Vroom or Screech or whatever. They had a couple cars like that. This is the Combat Medic as well. And here's the back of it. Pretty nice. It's real heavy too. I don't know how many I found. I may have only found one of those, or maybe there were a couple in there. Next one, uh, Grass Chomper. I could have gotten this at K Day, but um, I didn't see it in my bin. Bent up. I'll probably open it, and I'll probably do a video for it since it's a, a new model for 2016. I think you can put another f minifigure in here. 
Um, I think on the back of them it says Mega Blacks figure. I think this one does, but the tank nature doesn't say that. It's like a lawnmower, or right on a lawnmower. Okay, next one I got is from the series that they have at Target. Um, it's exclusive. It's like a retro card series, so the card's going to be retro. I think this card may not have been released whenever this card art was out. I think this is like early 90s, maybe 80s. But I looked this one up. I think it may have been a, like a 2000s release. It's a 77 Plymouth Arrow. They put the name and information here. Um, that information, not really sure what it really means. It says a toy number and assortment number, I guess. But it's all metal. Um, this is like a funny car, so the body should open up. Um, I only found one of these. These cars are actually a dollar twenty-nine. Not as expensive. Um, so if you have, a, if you're on a budget, you can, you know, buy these if you want. I'll probably only buy a few. I think some of these are all metal, like this one is. And here's some of the cars in that series. Um, I think maybe this one might be all metal, but I only found one at, at the Target store. I'll probably open it, though. But the wheel is kind of bent. If you can see right there, this wheel is bent up. Might be able to fix that because you can, you know, lift the body up. And I haven't seen any uh, funny cars lately, so I don't know if they're going to put them in the high price packaging so they can sell it higher but the next thing I got this is from a uh, Dollar General they had a sale buy one get one free so I found two cars um, this is the custom Volkswagen Beetle it's all metal um, I ha have a loose one here I'm gonna probably put this one in a in my uh, card collection and it's from 2014 I think I bought this when I started collecting um, at a, like a Dollar Tree and the one I have loose is kind of damaged a little. See, so you can tell it's all metal, but the little uh, tailpipe broke off. I don't know if that was plastic. But you can see it's kind of missing side by side. Yeah, it'd be longer. So I'll probably keep that one in the packaging. I'm, I saw this on Saturday, but I didn't pick it up because I figured that. Uh, they would have a sale, and this was last Saturday, because I scoped around. They had two cars I would have picked up, a uh, cool combi or this one, and I didn't see the cool combi. That was the 2015 one. Uh, I don't know what color that is, green. It wasn't a super at all. If it was, I probably would have picked it up that day. Pretty nice car. Um, the last car I have, it's probably kind of rare now, Ferrari uh, 599 GTB Furiano. Um, yellow. It's, it's a 2015 model B case. That car's kind of messed up. Um, I'll probably open it though. But they don't seem to be making Ferraris as Hot Wheels anymore. So that's kind of the reason why I picked it up. And a lot of times when I go to this dolly store, a lot of their Hot Wheels have never been moved as much. I'm probably the only one that you know purchases it purchases that stuff there. But that's it. That's all I found this week. Um, you can like, share, comment, subscribe to my videos. And, no, you can like, share, comment on my videos and subscribe to my channel if you want. And uh, have a nice day.